So today we got the trailer for the new DLC for Jurassic World Evolution 2, that being the Park Managers Collection Pack. Now this is something I'm really excited about, a lot of people weren't expecting it, people were guessing it could have been possibly the Xenozoic Pack, could have been a large species pack, could have been a coastal pack, but with yesterday's sort of like teaser, we was, I was thinking to myself, I wonder if it could be an aquatic pack, especially with the fact we can see kelp in the background. Now this is really exciting. It adds four new species to the game, ones that a lot of people have been after, you know, especially for a long time, especially for the fact for like things like microceratus, that's something that a lot of people have wanted adding to the game for a long time now and it's felt like it's been missing and now has finally been added which a lot of people are excited for but not only that we are getting Segisaurus, we're also getting the Megalodon uh, we are also getting Fanato Straken, which is a really cool addition a very large flyer which is something I'll be looking forward to a lot so anyways, let's get into this, let's see the trailer again, and I will go into showing some of the screenshots that came out with this trailer. In the background here got some screenshots of megalodon absolutely looks amazing i love the two-tone color as well as the spots on its back it kind of gives me that sort of like leopard sharps kind of like zebra shark kind of vibe to it as well we have this lovely group like photo of the microceratus like i love in the crawlers on the frill and the body it looks absolutely adorable next up we have segisaurus one that's definitely a fan favorite especially if you want to complete your jurassic park builds as you may know or may not know this was actually on the brochure seen on the map for the Jurassic Park so really cool addition to the game next up we have Fanato Straken something that I've not heard many people or seen in many lists of people want adding to the game but it's definitely a really cool addition it's one of the largest living uh, pterosaurs that we found so far in South America and definitely something I'm gonna be excited to see so I love seeing like flying creatures especially the large ones i love the trailer how it picked up a goat now it's kind of making me wonder have they secretly added in the ability for pterosaurs to walk on the ground or is that something we're not going to see so i'm definitely looking forward to anyways because how nice it looks something else that comes with this pack but not shown in any of the photos yet you can now get a little et skin for the t-rex if you really want to add that it's something i'll look forward to anyways because i'd like to have both of them walking around together and it'd be, it's just a really nice addition. So we've got a bit of information on the free update content. We're going to be getting kelp plants. Add some extra foliage to your lagoons with three new kelp plant decorations. So I'm definitely looking forward to use it and can't wait to get hold of. As well, we're going to get land-based lagoon lighting. A version of lagoon lights is coming in the free update that can build on land to illuminate your parks. So I know and heard a few people mention that they wanted. And uh, yeah. This all comes out on Thursday, the 16th of May this week. So very soon. And I really can't wait to show you guys all this new stuff. And yeah, anyways, in the comments below, let me know what you're excited for most. For me, it's probably going to be... It's a toss-up between Megalodon as well as the Phantos of Draken. Something I'm really looking forward to. I love flyers. I love aquatic creatures. So yeah, anyway, till next time, I'll see you later.